Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2022. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add some mood lighting to add a little interest and some movement to your footage. This can almost give you a cinemagraph look where you have a still image and just something in the image is moving. So here on my composition, I just have a still photograph. To add the mood lighting effect, just select the layer in the layers panel, go up to the effects and presets panel. If you don't see that, just go up to the window menu, click on window, then check effects and presets. Click in the search field and just start typing out mood. But we're gonna choose the first one, mood lighting amorphous. With the layer selected, you can just double click on it to apply it, or you can click and drag it right onto the layer. And if you press the space bar, you will see that the animation has been added automatically as soon as you apply the mood lighting effect. Pretty cool. You will also notice when you apply this effect, it actually applies two effects. It applies the mood lighting effect and fractal noise. And you can just uncheck these to see what each one's doing. The only thing I did was change the intensity from the default 50% down to 25% to give it a more subtle look. In a matter of seconds, I was able to take a still photo, add some movement to give it that cinemagraph look with some nice subtle mood lighting effect. And for the second example, I used the mood lighting effect to get more of that cinemagraph effect where most of the image is still and part of the image is animating. So all I did was drag this photo of a person looking out the window onto my composition window. Then I went over to the effects and presets and searched for mood and dragged the mood lighting amorphous effect right onto the photograph. That applied the effect on the entire photo, but I wanted to isolate it to just the window. So then what I did was just select the layer. I went up to the toolbar and I grabbed the pen tool. You can use the keyboard shortcut G. And all I did was just click around the window leaving the head in the background. I then added a CC composite effect. All that does is make a duplicate of the original. And if you don't wanna use the CC composite effect, if it confuses you, if you just don't wanna deal with that, before you do anything, you can just duplicate the still image, then apply the effects and the mask on the top layer, and that will give you the exact same results. Once you add the mask, go down to the layers panel, you can twirl it open and you're looking for masks, or you can use the keyboard shortcut M to bring up masks. Click on this drop down menu, change it from none to add, hit the space bar, and now it's still on the outside and there's movement in the window. And that is how to add the mood lighting amorphous effect in Adobe After Effects CC 2022. My name is Mike Murphy, cheers.